Welcome back to my channel. So it's been a while and I feel so bad that it has taken me so long to get back behind the camera but as you guys know I was in New York and I was just relaxing with my family because I haven't seen them for so long so I have not had the time to film but aside from that today I am back with a updated what's in my bag. I literally love these videos so so much. I'm so nosy. I want to know what's in every girl's bag. I picked up this new bag from Fossil. They were having this big sale where it was 30% off everything on their site so I went ahead and just looked and I found this really beautiful bag I picked up the Sydney satchel from Fossil it is made from real leather and this is the bag and I wanted to tell you guys this quickly now so that maybe you guys can catch that last minute sale um, this was originally $170 and then it was on sale I think for like a hundred and one or something like that or 110 and then the 30% off got it down to about like 86 bag went from 170 to 80 dollars which is crazy because it is real leather and it is fossil anyways I am in love with this bag if you guys saw my last what's in my bag it was a very small coach bag I love it still but mm, I have a lot of stuff and I need a bag that's not really big and can fit everything if that makes sense anyways this bag fits that criteria. I am in love with it. So let's just jump right into the what's in my bag portion and I'll just give you a little tour of the bag outside. So this is the bag outside. I got it in the color black. It just has a fossil logo here, um, gold detailing. It comes with a strap. In the back there is this cute little flap where I keep my iPhone. It fits it perfectly. So you don't have to always, you know, dig inside your bag for your phone. And then what's amazing about this bag is the two zippers that open the bag at the top. And when you open it all the way to the bottom like that, the bag like extends crazy. It becomes such a big bag, even though it is really tiny and cute. Inside, I just have my hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works. This is the pumpkin apple flavor. We're gonna start with the two front flaps, like the two bits. I'll just show you guys. We're gonna start with the two bits in the front there. In the first one, I just have my handy lotion, which is Moonlight Path, also from Bath & Body Works. It's one of my favorite lotions. Then I just have this cute little pen. I don't remember where I got it. Then I just have this spearmint gum. In the other flap on the other side, I have my lactose pills, which I, which I bring with me everywhere because I'm lactose intolerant, so I need to have them. Then I just bring around this chapstick here, a little eyelash comb, a lip gloss, which I never use. I don't know why that's in my bag. And then I recently just purchased this new Dior um, perfume and they gave me a little sample lip gloss. So I have this Dior Attic Lip Maximizer, which is also, don't mind my fingernails at the cuticle. Don't hate me. Um, yeah, so this little Dior Attic mini lip gloss. We're gonna start now with the back zipper here because once I get in the middle, we're basically, that's the back, so. So in the back zipper, I just have a little hair tie. I have my travel pads, which I bring with me everywhere. You never know what will happen. I have a little mirror. I have a extra mask, which I keep in there just in case I happen to forget one. Okay, now we're just gonna go with the contents of the bag. So in the back, there is this little notebook that I have started to carry around. Normally, instead of this, I would rather put a book, but this is a little bit more important for me right now. Um, in the book, there is just this cute little pen, which I got from AliExpress. And so this book is my diet minder personal food and fitness journal. And inside basically, basically helps you track how much food you've eaten in the day and since I've started the new diet where I want to just eat 1500 calories per day and alongside obviously exercise and so just to help me out this book cat like I can write down everything that I've eaten put down the calories and then at the end of the day calculate it and you can see on my first day I was overboard on some calories but anyways it's a good way to track what I've eaten so that I know 
I'm on track or not on track. Then I have this glasses case. It's nothing expensive, nothing crazy. Um, inside, I just keep my sunglasses. These are some cheap sunglasses that I got from TJ Maxx in New York, who cares? And then I also got these glasses, which I thought were very important for me since now I'm taking, I'm doing YouTube and I'm on my phone all the time. It's a blue lens glasses and it's supposed to help you when you're looking at a camera screen all the time or um, iPhone or the computer. So they're a little bit dirty right now, but this is basically what it looks like and I find that it really does help me and help my eyes relax a little bit, but let me just take a little thumbnail real quick. Okay, thumbnail over. Let's hope that I keep that thumbnail. In front of the sunglasses case, I have this little perfume that I carry around all the time. It's called Little Sugar and it's by Adopt. And I got this in the Paris train station when I went to go visit my friend in Paris. I have my travel charger. I have an inhaler in here because I was having some um, chest issues a while back and the doctor prescribed that I get this inhaler. I have this mini brush, which I always carry around. You know, you wanna comb out your hair. In this little blue pouch, I just have all my travel size perfumes. Then, because it was just recently summer, um, I always carry this in my bag. It is this Rexona, um, deodorant wipe basically so you know when you sweat and like maybe you lose some deodorant you can just take this out and wipe it and then you kind of have fresh deodorant so i don't have to carry like the big you know roller size deodorant then i just have these wet ones i actually got these in new york from my mom and basically you know use this now especially because of all the germs and corona just to wipe your hands then if you guys have seen my last what's in my bag this was in there it is this coach little wallet i tried to link it again it should still be on the website but i got this from the outlet and it just basically holds all of my cards and it's really handy so that all of these cards don't actually have to go into my wallet just behind that i have my actual wallet which is also from Coach. It was also in my last What's In My Bag. Um, so it's just this brown, cute wallet. This is absolutely my favorite wallet from Coach. You know, it just opens here. You put your bills here, and then inside this flap, you can have all of your coins. Moving on to the edge of the bag. Um, I have some tissues. Just in front of that, I have my handy dandy tripod, which I carry everywhere for my new camera, which is the Sony ZV-1. Bought the whole set and it came with this really cute tripod. You can hold it just to film or you can open it and set it down as a tripod. And it's really, really sturdy and really, really handy. And next, this is not the cutest case, but I think this camera is really new, so they don't have any cute cases out right now. This is just a case that I picked up from Best Buy and it holds my camera. I fit, put it in there. It holds the charger for the camera right there. If you guys notice, I don't carry a makeup bag because normally when I put on my makeup at the beginning of the day, it lasts me for the end of the day. So I never need to carry anything like a makeup bag, which is nice because that takes some space. Other than that, guys, that's what's in this huge but small and compact bag. Like, how cute is this bag? I love it so much. And it was kind of like a, I hope it's going to be a nice bag type of purchase. It turned out to be the best purchase. I've made so far. This is it all zipped up. The leather can still stretch. There, There is still room for more. It is just everything for me, so I love it. And it's also compared to the Louis Vuitton Speedy, I don't know, mini size, whatever size, but it's, I've also seen that on YouTube where they compare the size to the um, Speedy. So guys, that was the what's in my bag video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you guys are staying super duper safe and I will see you guys in my next video.